it is insignificant as to who drafted the document or which firm or which, that's not relevant, you know. What is relevant is that that document was entered into by Portico knowing full well that they were wrong in how they were getting it executed just before the general elections not being approved by cabinet nor the cabinet subcommittee. They knew that was wrong and that was not our policy. They knew that there was no way that particular minister had the authority to give certain concessions, especially when it comes to the waiving of taxes and fees and giving foreign exchange and all of that. They knew that. And they also knew that, and the current prime minister knows and should have known, because he supposedly is getting good legal advice, that that document is an illegal document in terms of it cannot stand commercially because it gives certain concessions not authorized, or the person who gave those concessions is not authorized to make those concessions. So he should have known that. So when the prime minister took that document a couple of weeks ago and tried to pass it in cabinet, it then became Johnny Briseño's document, you know. It became, I know you all don't like to hear that. You don't want to hear that. You don't, but if you support something and I pick it up and I run with it, I am in support of it too, am I not? I want to investigate. I will support an investigation by the Ombudsman to determine what would make the Prime Minister take such a document to Cabinet, knowing full well that that document was egregious and unacceptable. What made you do that? What, what provoked you to do that?